Hey guys, welcome to Crafters Paradise tutorial series. Today we're going to be exploring the concept of negative and positive spaces using the Cinelia and Dream Watercolorist kit. First off, sketch your selected subject lightly on the watercolor paper to try and avoid visible pencil mark afterwards. Keep the drawing of the subject as simple as possible. The next step is using the drawing gum and a brush to trace over the sketch. The drawing gum will act as a barrier, resist and preserve the areas covered white. The drawing gum will take approximately 10 to 15 minutes to dry before we can proceed to paint. Start by using the lighter colours on the base layer as watercolour employs layering painting techniques, usually from light to dark colours. Apply the paint directly on your watercolour paper. This is known as the wet on dry technique where the wet paint is applied on a dry surface. Once finishing with the lighter base colour, still following the light to dark rule, apply the other colours directly on the still damp painted surface. This is known as the wet-on-wet wet technique, which produces various interesting effects such as paint bloom and runs. Using the earlier techniques, complete painting your subject. Remember to leave an allowance between the painted subject and the background to allow the paint to breathe and spread, so as not to smudge or blotch the colours. Once completed, allow the painting to dry before attempting to remove the layer of gum. This is to prevent tearing the damp paper when we remove the gum. Once completely dried, we can proceed to remove the gum. Using your fingers, rub firmly and the drawing gum should come off easily. If need be, use a soft polymer eraser to remove any visible sketch marks. And voila! Here we have a completed watercolour painting that explores the concept positive and negative while picking up a few watercolour techniques along the way. Hope you guys enjoyed a short tutorial with me. Till the next episode, this is Hafiza and enjoy your art making! Woo!